Alright guys, today I'm going to show you a more up-to-date um, tutorial on how to install or apply Minecraft mods. Now, ever since version, what, 1.2, actually when I made my other video that was an alpha, um, you had to install the, the texture packs directly into the directory directly into the directory um, and now you don't um, you have to put them in a folder and I'll, I'll show you in a sec so you're on the minecraft forums right all the texture packs are located and supported here you scroll down to um, mapping and modding and you click texture packs you have other mods as well, but they have installation instructions and you can follow them from there, but this is how to install in, uh, any texture pack, most of the time. Alright, actually I didn't show you, right? When you go in, when you click texture packs, um, click this topic, right? This is very helpful, it will show you every texture pack that has ever been released and it goes on for ages and there's like 30, 30 pages of just tons of f um, files um, so yeah um, I am not going to install a custom one uh, I mean uh, I'm not going to install a new one since I already have two but oh wait aha right Clean Design Pack, this is the one that I'm currently using, I love it, it looks very nice. So, you would go onto the mod, obviously, and this this guy here provides an image map big download button. You just click it, and the download is available instantly, so click um, save, and that's it done. Um, you can minimize your browser right now. Uh, right, so this is your texture pack here. Right, you would uh, right click, cut, and I did say that you have to go into run, but you actually don't. You can do it that way if you want, but what I do is I just percentage app, that app percentage, hit enter, Minecraft, and texture packs, and you paste your texture packs in here, and you can have, you can have tons. Um, I'm pretty sure you can have like a lot and if they don't work very simple you can just uh, disable them and then delete them from here and um, to install advanced texture packs that would need to still alter the directory some people will say download winzip jzip 7zip I prefer WinRAR because out of all of them it's the best because um, WinRAR can, I think, as far as I know, right, WinRAR is the only one that can alter ISOs um, and a lot other ones so I just use that and it's 64 bit as well. So whatever, you just open it and get all the files and drag them to your desktop for now and I'm just going to delete this go back into the directory bin and like I said last time you can click minecraft up here WinRAR or right click open with WinRAR and everything is the same in here but what you're going to be doing is you're going to select all the um, I'm going to delete this because I don't need it uh, well yeah, all right, you can put that in. Um, just select all the files, drag them in, and click OK. But I'm not going to do that uh, because I don't want to. And that's pretty much it. That's how to install advanced and easy uh, installation texture packs.